it lost, especially in the Wi-Fi. Like they did before when like even locals were going on, when, when like local word was easier to come across. But in, in the Wi-Fi era, there's a lot of good results that people are getting that you don't really notice. But oh boy, let's go. Okay, this is gonna be chunky against Solhex. Solhex, a hell of a Bowser, but he might be dead right here. He's my, okay, okay, he's living. Oh my god. You, you've seen too many of the false combo mm -hmm. videos, my guy. <laughs> oh, yeah. I, I'm only very familiar with the one, actually, but uh, I have watched Chunky play a good amount. It's the Just, only It's the only one I I'm need, a, Sean. I'm waiting I'm waiting for him to drop a, a Steve clip. I'm just waiting, dude. He's gonna. He's going to come out with a crazy Steve clip. Like, it's just facts. He, he's done it for every DLC character. He's come out with something crazy, so we'll see. Anyway. That, that is the meme we actually need in this election season. Um, But, yeah, he's oh, on really just gonna up be like that that is disrespectful but yeah that drop kick as oh, powerful geez. as ever and the knuckle duster once again being deployed at the ledge soul hex at 13 percent that's uh a pretty lead pretty decent lead that they've accrued there though again nothing lasts forever especially not in this match yeah, and that's just a great job taking... Uh, the thing with DK is his disadvantage state is just horrible. Like, it's just... You're, you're essentially guessing with him or, or just getting abused in, in the disadvantage. So, great job here, though. Spacing it out. Chunky, exceptional with... You can see the spacing on not just his down B, but the forward smash to close that one out. And a back air again. Solhex firing back. This is Godzilla against King Kong. The whole damn stage is shaking. The whole city is shaking. Already, we're seeing a lot of pressure there. Chunky with the aerial mobility. But uh, here comes Solhex. Don't count him out. Oh, he's got the lead, actually. Never mind. This is this is ridiculous, dude. There's too much going on right now. Too much offense, which is insane. I'm having to fortify my desk as we speak, so if you see gaps in my commentary, that is exactly why. But looking for the up throw into the up air. Oh, and uh, oh. on some Smash 4 stuff. Looking for the footstool. And, yeah, we saw that. Uh, <gasps> oh, my gosh. Forward throw. Soul Wait. Hex. He burned his jump control. so early, dude. And, and having to deal with that forward tilt is going to be really hard as, as DK. Is that going to do it? That's close. No, 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 no. Good DI there by Chunky Kong, who, again, you're dealing with something. But, yeah, you got your roll called out. That's all you need to do. Just hit him with the back of your ring hand, Soul Hex, straight up on some play a hate of crap right there. And now it's 1-0 uh, to Soul Hex. Chunky Kong on the ropes here. I mean, that was really good uh, by Soul Hex. That's the thing with DK, man. His disadvantage is just so rough. His hurt box is just huge. It's just huge. He rolled. That up tilt covered pretty much everything unless he got really creative. Like, pretty sure it would hit jump at the right time. Definitely we could, could catch a neutral get up, and it obviously caught the roll as well. That that side B, though, that was almost Bowser getting the Bowser treatment where his opponent barely lives at 150 and just turn around and kills him uh, instantly, so... Yeah, man, well played. What a banger of a game one. And the thing with it, let me see where they end up, actually. I, it sounded like they went back to FD because it was really quick. Yeah, FD is just brutal for both these characters. The disadvantage stage is just horrible for both of them when they're trying to land from above. These space out down beans. Oh, here we go. Hold on. What's he got? Oh, he's trying to cheese him. Oh, I love it. The double cheese. All that extra sharp. Oh, Good yeah. Work, <laughs> yeah, the, yeah, the pepper jack. You gotta love it from uh, from Chunky Kong. But yeah, that's 72% uh, right now. Why are we even talking about the percentages? They're just gonna hit each other three times and they one of them will die eventually. Yep. Like that. Like that, pretty much. Thank you, Soul Hex. Soul Hex been so good off stage, man. Ledge trapping, all that stuff. And that's where you have to be DK because as phenomenal as the player as Chunky Kong is, he's still, like his, his character is limited to, to what he is uh, when he's getting off the ledge and when he's in a bad spot with that back air. Amazing. I think it's, I still think that's DK's best move overall. It's so good. It kind of sets the pace for him in a lot of ways. Neutral KOing, off stage edge guarding. But here we go. The combo tool reads the defensive option. Oh, shit. No, he's good. Okay. He's out. Dude, it feels like one of them has a huge lead and then it just goes away. I mean, there's definitely something to be said about, you know, about DK for some reason getting the frame data for Clouds Up Air in Smash 4. But uh, I don't know. That back air is uh, certainly. I mean, I think that a lot of DKs would be in agreement with you about that being uh, their best move. It's disjointed. It hits so well. And really, it's been a staple of uh, DKs for quite some time now. But yeah, you are just going to get every single option covered by Soul Hex, who's looking to move on here, trying to punch their ticket to a, to a spot in Loser's Final against Delta Force. That's a huge whiff grab right there. That was 40, a 40% swing just in terms of what Chunky Kong cooked, cooked from that pressure. But now we have 
Soul Hex. He was looking for a scared object to attack or something. Okay. Dash attack. What's he looking for? Oh, he air dodged. I can't believe he air dodged right there. Crazy option. Oh no. Oh no. What's going on? Okay. Backer to backer combat. Nice job by Soul Hex. Ooh, oh, boy. oh my gosh. Actually, just going for the up smash. That was borderline rude. It didn't even cover as much as up tilt, I don't think. But a shield in the F smash. That's uh, a shaky proposition, but no shield breakage. You're okay. And looking, Ooh, covering it, yeah. everything with the up tilt. And again, that's going to be Soul Hex just spinning the shell on the stage. And uh, Chunky Kong spinning their tires in uh, elimination bracket. Just uh, too much for that DK to handle. Soul Hex moving on 2 0. That was really nice, man. What a fun matchup to watch, honestly. Just two heavies beating the crap out of each other. Neither one of them ever really backed off. It was just kind of like just spacing around. Almost like two sorties, but a lot goofier and a lot bigger hurt boxes. So that was a lot of fun, man. Uh, well played, dude, by both players. But of course, moving on, we do have Soul Hex. I mean, we saw him play earlier, and that Link matchup looked rough. But we're going to get to see a run back here. Delta Force against Soul Hex. Bowser against Link. Uh, Delta Force did take this one down. I believe it was 2-0. Yeah, it was. Yeah. yeah. I mean, it's everything. It's everything you love.